Recently, I encountered this issue. When I was using Jet Engine's listing grid, I was showing a list of posts. I wanted to show a badge only on items with a particular parent, which I created using Jet Engine relation feature. And I figured it out. So in this video, I'll show you how to do that. I'm Naomi from WP Tofu. If you like topics like this, please subscribe. Let's get started. Okay, so these are the plugins I have now. And I have two post types I want to connect, which is superhero. Well, if you don't know superhero, each superhero comics have a publisher, Marvel and DC. So we are going to connect these two first. Probably some of you already know, what relation, add a new name, let's say superhero and publisher. So usually the parent object is a publisher. So I choose publisher, child object is superhero. And it's one-to-one, -one. it's a one-to-many relationship, right? Because publishers one and superheroes many, so. All right, so actually that's it. You can add a relation to it. Next, we are going to create listings. I already have something like this, but uh, this is from a different video. So post type is a superhero because I want to create a list of superhero. Superhero listing item. Okay. Here, go to settings, listing settings. It's a little too big, so kind of make it smaller here. The, go to dynamic image. It's already showing the Batman here, but maybe to make it center dynamic field all right all right so update so I'm going to create a new page and this is superhero page <clears throat> and edit with Elementor resting grid show superhero so now I see a list of superheroes here. Uh, maybe you pull. Good. So now we'd like to add if it is DC, which is Superman and Batman, they are from the DC comics. Everybody else is Marvel. So if it's DC or Marvel, let's put some text here saying that it's DC or from Marvel. Okay. So now we have to create add a relation to these each items. So to add relation, go to each these post items and now you see parent publisher. So connect publisher and click, uh, it was Batman, so DC and connect, update. So I'll do that for the rest of the hero now. Okay, well, I added all the publisher here. So now what do we do is Go to Jet Engine and it will enable this feature called Dynamic Visibility for Widget and Sections. And save. Now we want to update the listing item we created. However, open Publisher in New Tab first. Like this, okay? Then go to Listings and update this superhero listing. Edit with Elementor. Here, Okay, I said a text, but let's add an image. So click this image widget and let's choose Marvel first. I know this is not Marvel character, but Marvel. And go to Add Advanced tab and go to Dynamic Visibility. This was enabled just now. So enable it here and choose Show Element if Condition Met and Condition here. Condition. I tried several, but it seems like a contain works. Contains field. Here is a key. There are many, but there's a related items. 
okay from relation superhero and publisher and from object is not child it's a parent object if you made it other way it has to be other way I tried it both works okay and here's the key I didn't know what to put in this value then I figured out if you go to this page let's say open marble now go to the URL and here I see the post equal 95 it, probably yours have a different number and copy this and then go back and paste it here okay update so now do you see it shows in Marvel Marvel I don't know I'm not if I'm saying it right but so let's put the DC too all right we're back here so maybe we can duplicate this right and this bottom one we can choose DC okay I know DC logo is bigger I mean taller and go back to the advanced tab dynamic visibility same thing but it's not 95 DC mines 93 so press 90, uh, paste 93 here and update so I'm back this page and refresh so now this is DC marble says marble also what if you add non marvel or dc character like mega man okay if i add something like that and no relations are associated with it then mega man doesn't have any dc or marvel sign here see you can do many things with it what did you guys think was it difficult a little bit if you have any comments questions requests please leave it in the comment section i'm naomi from wp tofu Thank you for watching.